Appernetti Jones and Company. My name is Tara Thompson. I'm an attorney with the Exoneration Project in Chicago. We appreciated you covering our Dixmore 5 case, and like the guys in the Dixmore 5 case, Jamie Snow's innocent. He could use the help of a show like yours to investigate his case and to show the truth that we already know, which is that he's innocent and that he's a victim of an injustice. So we hope you'll investigate his case. We hope you'll look into it and decide that this is a case that's worthy of your time and your coverage. You can contact us anytime, and you know to go to www.freejamiesnow.com. Thank you so much. My name is Amber Casey. My name is Nicole Snow, and we're Jamie Snow's daughters. Miss Jones, we really need your help. Please look into Jamie's case. He's serving life without parole for a crime he did not commit. Please look into this case. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, my name's Alan. I'm a family friend. My name's Thomas, and Jamie's my grandpa. Uh, Miss Jones, we'd really appreciate it if you uh, could help in any way, shape, or form. Anything would help. We really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Hi, I'm Robin. And I'm Valerie. And we're Jamie's sisters. Miss Jones, we need your help. Please look into the case for Jamie Snow. He is serving a life sentence without parole for a crime that he did not commit. We need your help again. Please help us. Thank you. Hi, Aphrodite. My name is Kay Lincoln, and I'm speaking to you today to ask you to look into the Jamie Snow case. Jamie was wrongfully convicted of a murder he did not commit. There's a lot of information out there, if you look for it, that will prove Jamie's innocence. What Jamie needs is someone with a national audience to come forward and help him. I know this works. My dad, Rodney Lincoln, was also convicted of a crime he did not commit. And what broke the, the case for him and has made all the difference in the world is the national media attention that he got from Crime Watch Daily. It's actually going to be, I believe, what frees him very soon. Jamie needs this type of help. We're just asking you to please look into it. I know that you will find that you were right and that Jamie is innocent. Please give him some help. Thank you. My name is Kelly Thompson and I am from Springfield, Illinois. Miss Jones, we need your help. Please take a look into the Jamie Snow case. He is serving life without parole for a crime he didn't commit. He needs your help. 16 years is too long. Thank you. Miss Jones, my name is Brian Tippy. I'm from Springfield, Illinois. We desperately need your help. Uh, we urge you to look into the Jamie Snow case. Uh, he's an innocent man who is serving life behind bars without parole due to poor prosecution uh, tactics. Uh, we ask for your assistance. We ask you to do what you do and do it well and help uh, exonerate this man and get him free as he should be. Thank you. My name is Aaron and I'm from Bloomington, Illinois. Miss Jones, we would please like your help. Please take a look into the Jamie Snow case. He is serving a life, a life sentence without parole for a crime he did not commit. He you needs your help. We would appreciate it. Thank you, ma'am. Hello, Miss Jones. My name is Kim DeFries, and I'm in Bloomington, Illinois. Uh, my friend Jamie is serving life in prison without parole for a crime he did not commit, and we need your help. Miss Jones, I'm begging you to take a look into this case and, and help us out. Jamie needs justice, an innocent man was killed, and his family needs justice, and we know that with you, we can get that help that we need. So again, I just beg you from Bloomington, Illinois, to take a look into this case and help our friend Jamie out. Thank you so much. Hi, my name is Pamela Wilson. This is Michelle DeWitt Zimmerman. I am from Clarksville, Tennessee. Michelle is from Bloomington, Bloomington Illinois. Illinois. And we need your help. Please take a look into the Jamie Snow case. He is serving life without parole for a crime he did not commit. I would bet my life on that fact, wouldn't you, Michelle? I would definitely bet my life on that. Jamie, Jamie did not do this innocent. crime. I, I would put everything I own against that fact. For the last 16 years, someone else is yes. living free who committed this crime. While he suffers in prison. While Jamie suffers. Um, and his family. And his family. He needs your help, so please. He needs your help. Please help us and thank you. Thank you. Hi, my name is Randy. I'm from North Carolina. And Miss Jones, we really need your help. If you could please look into the Jamie Snow case. He's been in prison for 16 years for a crime he didn't commit. Thank you. My name is Rhonda Miracle and I am from North Carolina. Miss Jones, we need your help. Please look into the Jamie Snow case. He is serving life without parole for a crime he didn't commit and he needs your help. I am not a family member, I am a friend, and I've read his case, I have visited him uh, in Stateville, 
I've sat across the table from him for hours and talked at length about a lot of things. And uh, I am personally convinced, based on what I've read and also sitting down across the table from him eye to eye, and he did not do this crime. He is a, a wonderful man, but he's an innocent man too. So please thank you for any help that you can give. Thank you. Hi, my name's Tammy, I'm from Peoria. Mrs. Jones, we need your help. I've known Jamie forever and I need to take a look into this case. He really needs your help. He didn't commit this himself. Thank you. My name is Tammy Alexander and I'm from Memphis, Tennessee. I've uh, known Jamie Snow for about eight years now. Um, we are asking you, Miss Jones, to please do a story on this case. It is definitely a genuine wrongful conviction. Jamie is being represented by the Exoneration Project. He's got a, a, some great people behind him, tons of support. You know, we, several of us have worked for years, um, just supporters getting FOIA requests, lots and lots of documentation, and, and found plenty of things, exculpatory evidence, things that were not turned over before trial. Um, he currently has a, a, a federal habeas, and a decision is supposed to be made on that in um, on August 19th. We also have a DNA motion and uh, before the circuit court in McLean County, and we have tried um, everything we can to get this DNA tested. There is DNA, it has never ever been tested, and that's, we've also had jailhouse informants, and we know that that if a, a national story is done on this case, that some of these people will come forward. And it's so critical. We, we know that you can do this and that he needs national attention to this case so we can get these people to come forward and do the right thing and tell the truth. Anyways, thank you so much for all that you do and all that you have done. And uh, we hope that you will at least take a look into the Jamie Snow case and you can find out more and contact us at freejamiesnow.com. Thanks.